So I'm at the latest Tesla supercharger. There is 168 stalls. This marks the largest one in the world. And there is also a 11 megawatt farm out here as well. Um, and then as you can see over here, there is literally a bunch of stalls so you can pull through your trucks if you're carrying or hauling anything. But everything is pretty much protected by solar. Um, and only 84 of these stalls have been set up. So we're gonna do a quick walkthrough. But literally this is like the largest one that I personally have ever seen. Um, I've seen the Harris Ranch one, which is pretty, pretty big as well. But if you just walk through here, you can just see uh, they lit this up like three or four days ago. And it's like literally the mid middle of nowhere. And my understanding is this is completely self-sustaining with the farm out there that they have. Uh, so I'm gonna throw the camera up, but this thing is just absolutely So my understanding too is they are going to be launching a lounge here and this will compete probably against Kettleman City, but knowing Tesla, they're gonna kill it. And one thing we as Tesla owners love is being able to have our own lounge. That's super, super cool. So uh, again, we're just gonna keep walking through here, giving you a tour, uh, but this is the largest supercharger in the world right now. As we know, Tesla loves to outdo themselves, uh, but this is super unique. Again, completely self-sustaining supercharger, 168 stalls, 84 are activated right now. The rest, as you can see over here, are actually just covered up and they will be activated along with the lounge later this year. So again, really cool, super special, completely in the middle of nowhere. I mean, if you look at this place, there's like nothing around at all. And I do love to see Tesla obviously puts their logo, you can see it better lit up over there, but just super, super cool. All right, so I can also see there's a couple people, there's a couple people here in ICE cars, uh, and there's actually even a truck and a trailer over there. You can tell that people uh, are here just making sure that this is up and running safely. Uh, the Teslas are rolling in. This thing again has been activated. It's only been live for like three days, but this is the largest supercharger in the world. So pretty cool at that. Again, I personally cannot wait for the lounge uh, and them to fully activate this. This is gonna help with congestions at various locations that um, especially during holidays, and also too, this thing is now open up to all EVs. I just saw a Hyundai Ioniq and a, what is it? A Chevy Silverado EV. And you know what's insane is that um, the peace of mind that these EV owners have now, non-Teslas, is crazy. Sure, they might be paying a little bit more per kilowatt hour, but the safety of mind being able to check into the Tesla superchargers, it's a complete life hack and changes their whole range anxiety. Uh, because Electrify America is a complete mess. So super cool. Again, the solar farm out there, which is pretty cool. Uh, I'm gonna lift this thing up again, but super cool. All right, so I'm just walking through here and you can see right now we have the bathrooms here. Again, this is probably just temporary. Um, but yeah, this is gonna be super cool. So I'm uh, finishing up my little quick vlog of the world's largest Tesla supercharger. Again, it's a game changer. It's gonna have a lounge, 168 stalls, 11 megawatt solar farm out there, completely self-sustaining. 
a ton of locations for you to pull in if you have a trailer. Um, but Tesla continues to raise the bar. So this is the, the biggest one as of today. Crazy.